hi guys in this video i will show you how to fix instant geyser not turning on due to your tank low height if your water tank is located on a single story roof then it will cause problem due to low height i will show you how to fix this with the help of a one button and wire so watch the video complete don't skip any part subscribe our channel and like the video now when I open the water tape, you are watching its pressure is low due to low water tank height. You are watching our geyser is not turning on. Again I will show you when I open the water tape and it tries to power on but then off again. So this is the problem due to low height of water tank. There are four screws. Open these screws and pull the front knobs used to control water and gas. After all the front knobs have been pulled, now take the front cover. We have to work on the water inlet pipe. There should be a sensor located on it with the black color. You can see that it is located on the water inlet pipe. We have to remove its connection. We have disengaged it. You can see that these black wires are coming from the sensor. So basically we are trying to on off the geyser by ourselves so we can manually control it because the water pressure is low this is automatic when you open the water tap the water goes upside and the magnetic sensor start works take a piece of wire double wire we will attach it here the wire that goes to the magnetic sensor peel off the wire and connect it Insert it from the downside and connect it to the sensor wire. I have connected the wires. Now take a on off button and connect wires other side to this. Viewers, this is very good method where your water pressure is low and your instant geyser doesn't turn on automatically now the button is connected now i will show you the demo by turning it on you can see the fire comes up and the geyser is started so this is how we can control the geyser turning on and off by manually installing a button Now close the geyser front side, attach all the knobs and viewers there is a tip, doesn't turn the button on before opening the water tape because it will damage the metal inside the geyser. Firstly turn on the tape then power on the button. You are watching the temperature is rising and the fire is lit here you can see that now the temperature is gradually rising this method is very useful the tip is this viewers always open the water tape first then power on the button and power off the button first then turn off the water tape we have manually attached a button to this the water is very hot it's almost boiling hope this video helps thanks for watching goodbye